Well, let me just ask you uh, as an aside about uh, Satya Nadella, the CEO of Microsoft. He seems to have successfully transformed Microsoft into into this fresh, innovative, developer-friendly company. I agree. What do you, I mean, it's really hard to do for a very large company. Uh, what what have you learned from him? Why do you think he was able to do this kind of thing? Um, yeah, what what insights do you have about why this one human being is able to contribute to the pivot of a large company into something uh, very new? I think most CEOs are either great leaders or great managers. And from what I observe, have observed with Satya, he is both super visionary, really like gets people excited, really makes long duration and correct calls. And also he is just a super effective hands-on executive and I assume manager too. And I think that's pretty rare. I mean, Microsoft, I'm guessing like IBM or like a lot of companies have been at it for a while, probably have like old school kind of momentum. So you like inject AI into it, it's it's very tough or, or anything, even like open source, the, the culture of open source. Um, like how how hard is it to walk into a room and be like, the way we've been doing things are totally wrong. Like, I'm sure there's a lot of firing involved or a little like twisting of arms or something. So do you have to rule by fear, by love? Like what can you say to the leadership aspect of this? I mean, he's just like done an unbelievable job, but he is amazing at being like clear and firm and getting people to want to come along, but also like compassionate and patient with his people too. I'm getting a lot of love, not fear. I'm a big Satya fan. <laughs> so am I from a distance.